Oh, it's you. What do you want? You mean with him again? Aren't you? And what of it? Me and the others have been talking. We know that you've been colluding with that beast. Can you really not see that I'm doing this for you? Does Hegel's plan not inspire you? No! You're scaring all of us. We know what Hegel is capable of. We know what he's planning. If you are not with me, then you're against me. Traveller, please. We cared about you. I loved you. But if this is the path you're taking, then I can't see you anymore. And you won't be welcome at Scorchwood anymore either. They've already raised the tier 6 alarm, and they're searching for you as we speak. I don't care if they're looking for me. You don't know what I'm capable of. This is what I mean. I don't know what you are anymore. I don't think I ever knew you. None of us knew you. You're just some power-hungry husk who sees people as flesh. <laughs> It's a shame. What a waste. Wish I'd had time to absorb her energy. But erasure was the only option I had time for. I came as requested. What news do you have? I have begun to assemble the pieces of the operator. Soon, we will be able to activate the machine. Isn't the machine the only thing in this universe that could harm you? Yes. And it's also the only thing in this universe capable of allowing me to enter this world fully, so that I may rebuild it anew into something beautiful. Do the pieces of the Operator know what you have planned? No. I grant the sign when it is unknown to them, and I will keep it that way. You worry about your side of the deal. We'll need the Operator to activate the machine and manipulate it into a blank state. about the machines. The humans from the times of old committed their final sin and built themselves a god, one capable of reshaping anything and everything to its will. The ones from the walls ended the human experiment before the machine could be fully configured, sentencing it to flow aimlessly through the higher plane it was banished to. The machine, in its limited state, began to dream. It replicated itself countless times creating a plethora of machines in its own godly image, each one an expression of a different side of its personality. These machines were lesser, but still unfathomably powerful. 
The lesser machines have begun to leak into this realm, and Hegel has tasked me with commandeering as many as I can in order to help him grow stronger. According to Hegel, once the machine has been configured by the operator, I will have to consume them and use their power to merge with the machine. I will become the central vessel which carries the beginning of something greater. I've never had anything to look forward to in my life, but this, this is something that gives me hope. I am finally alive. The next lesser machine has bled through. I must secure it before Scorchman finds it. Don't look at me like that. I've done what I had to. <laughs> Haven't you stopped for even a second to slow down and think about what you've done? Why would I? I have all that I need. What? No, you don't! You ruined everything! Ruined? I rather think I've improved things. You had friends, a community, someone loved you. You're a part of something. You're alive and actually qualified as a person for once. And I felt nothing! I was never meant to be a person. Never meant to settle into a life. I'm just a traveler. A traveler between the finely drawn lines that define a clear image of what being is. I'm not a person, but an instrument of decay.